brain. Trixie, wait up! What's the deal? One minute we're having breakfast, and the next you tear off on your mega. Yeah, I mean, I said I was sorry. It wasn't my fault. It was Pronto's cooking. It takes an iron stomach to digest casserole a la molinoid. That's not why I took off. Well, not the main reason. <laughs> I couldn't help it when I saw it. It's really real. No way. The Enigmo Slug actually exists. This isn't sitting well. Ooh, you might want to clear out. Now, Ooh. Enigmo Slug? Never heard of it. What's it do that's so special? Nobody knows. Everyone always thought the Enigma Slug was just a legend. This is probably the last one in existence. Nobody's ever seen one transformed. So if we hurry, we can be the first to fire it and find out. Even better, we can be the first to get that on video. This place is incredible. It's nice to see parts of Slug Terror that are still unspoiled. <laughs> so much for being unspoiled. Huh? And so much for being the first to get here. Slug Hunters, and they're after the Enigma. before they destroy this entire jungle. No way. Second you get some of that mushroom salad in your mecha's gears, it's gonna go all And I guess we're going on foot court. Come on. Come on. Slug hunting on foot. So uncivilized. Ah, no! This is how you do it! Yeah, if you don't really care about getting the Enigma. Oh, but we are quite eager to have it. Hmm, as soon as one of you finds it, we'll be here to buy it. For a very fair price. I wouldn't exactly call that fair. More like a crazy, insane mech load of money! Oh, with such riches, we could do much good for Bronto. Oh, I could finally get a new mecha beast with a comfy seat and less attitude. Or a bejeweled handbag with a comb pocket. Oh, no, wait! A new scarf! Bronto, snap out of it! That is a lot of gold. I don't know if I could sell it. Oh, I doubt you'll have the chance. There's already a lot of competition. But if you do manage to catch it first, we'll be here waiting. gonna pay two tons of gold for you. Hey! You almost flattened us. Let me do the talking tricks. Look, we're all eager to find the Enigma, but maybe there's a less, you know, blowy-uppy way to do it. 
Hey, you know what? This kid's right. Instead of using hop rocks, it'd be quicker to use flaringos and burn these trees down. <laughs> <laughs> How about next time, Eli? I do the talking. Definitely. Pronto! Tazelang's behind you! On it! <laughs> That didn't work. Sorry about that. Yeah, I want to go home now. Look! I think I saw the Enigma crawl under there. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Bro! Oh, never mind. Just a crummy leaf. <laughs> okay, that was not cool. Huh? Whoa. Now that's a serious trap. <laughs> and that is really not cool. Huh. What kind of slug are you? Slugs live here, not just the Enigmo. You're tearing their cave to shreds. And look at this. It could have killed this slug. Uh, Eli? And that's the Enigmo. <gasps> huh? And that is my trap. Stalker? Uh, I didn't know you were here, too. We won't get in your way. Leave. <laughs> so, you do the talking this time? Are you crazy? That's Gerhold Stalker, the deadliest game hunter in Slug Terra. He doesn't do talking. They say if you see him, it's already too late. Hence why he is called SBD. Silent, but deadly. <laughs> Sorry, where I'm from, silent but deadly means something else. He's right behind me now, huh? The Enigma Slug. And my trap. Now. Hey, I found him fair and square before he fell into your trap. I didn't come here to play fair. I came here for the slug with the two-tongue payday. <laughs> I knew you should have done the talking. <laughs> Split up! You want this slug? Okay, well, here it comes! <laughs> You gotta tell me what it looked like when it transformed. I can't. Why not? Because I kind of couldn't see it. <laughs> Where'd they go? 
Don't ask me. Cord, Eli got hit by the Enigma, and now his eyes aren't working right. Actually, I can see plenty. In fact, I think I'm seeing twice as much as I should. Here they come! <laughs> Did I get him? Yeah. I'll take that as a no. Huh? Come on! I would suggest that perhaps we move along. Stalker could be anywhere. Yeah. Right behind you. Stalker is almost as legendary as Pronto. Yeah, but for entirely different reasons. Of course! Pronto is known for his undisputed magnificence, and Stalker is known for his traps. He's probably seeded this very cave with them. That is why you all must walk in the footsteps of Pronto's expert. Ah, you see? I found one. This locking mechanism's way high tech, but I think I see how to engineer a workaround. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> well, I suggest that with Eli utterly and completely useless... Dude, I can still hear, you know. Uh, sorry. Anyway, I would still suggest we leave before Stalker can find us. We can't leave. The Enigma did this to Eli, and there's no telling if it will ever wear off on its own. Huh? We need to find the Enigma to figure out how to cure him. Yeah, if Stalker doesn't have it already. Oh, I assure you, he does not. What makes you say that? Because it is right over there. <laughs> and it's playing on a tripwire! Huh? I got it! <laughs> you okay? Just a slug trank dart. You know how many of these it would take to bring down a cave troll? <laughs> yeah, that's about right. <laughs> Cord! Come on, we've got to get the Enigma before they do. But we can't just leave them. Stalker wants the Enigma, not Cord. He will be here when we return. The Enigma is close. Keep your eyes peeled. Currently the wrong guy for that job. Maybe a little zoom action will help. Yes, there it is! Ugh, is this the dumbest slug in history? No wonder there's only one of them left. I'm okay. Pronto, it's all on you. Go! Whoa! Yeah. Track only frightened prey. If we stay still and show no fear, they will not menace us. You see? Ah, uh, no. Now, we go for the Enigma. Uh, with confidence. Just ignore the hounds' razor sharp teeth, their piercing eyes, their claws that could so easily rip you to shreds. <laughs> What happened? Did you get the Enigma? 
yes. Huh? I did. That's it? You're just gonna walk away? Finish him. Wait! I wasn't complaining. I was just asking. Don't worry, Burpee. Just have to show him we're not afraid. Of course, that'd be easier if I wasn't quite so scared. Dogs can't climb trees. Huh? <sighs> but apparently slug hounds can. Chiller, spinner, I need you. <laughs> spinner, you're up. <laughs> can't really see much of anything. And if you leave with the Enigma, you're taking the best shot I've got to fix that and find my way out, and find my friends. I know that slug is worth a ton of gold to you, but it's worth a whole lot more than that to me. So as long as I can stand, I'm not giving up. You talk too much. That's not what I wanted. I can see! Maybe too much. traps hidden all over, but I've got the best secret weapon in this cave. <laughs> Whoa! Sure glad you make good traps there, buddy. Now, got anything you want to say to Enigma <laughs> before you never see him again? Didn't think so. Come on, let's get our friends and get out of here. So wait, the most legendary slug of legend basically just messes your eyes up and then fixes them when it hits you again? But imagine hitting the other guy with it first. It would totally take him out of the fight. And even though I couldn't see straight, it was almost like... 
It was letting me see more than normal, like it was showing me something else. Ah, so you're saying there's more to Enigma than meets the eye? Well, yeah. If you want to put it in the lamest way possible, <laughs> sure. Look, I believe that our <coughs> mechas should be right through there. <gasps> oh, now this is a surprise. Let me guess, you were expecting Stalker? <laughs> he might be a while. You're welcome to wait for him, but he doesn't have this. Well done. Name your price. Well, considering what me and all my friends just went through, I don't think I'm leaving one of them behind. <coughs> and as one of those friends, I say you're completely wrong. Think of what that money could do for Brondo. Our card for when you change your mind. Thanks, but you may be waiting a while for that one too. Uh, no, you won't. Uh, I will convince him. Uh, Eli, stop! Uh, think of all the things we could buy. The foot massagers, uh, the neck warmers, ruby-plated pimple poppers! <sighs> Fluffy stuffed tushy pillows? You know, I've thought about it, and blowing up Black's refinery without a plan wasn't smart. Now you have second thoughts? No. I just said it wasn't smart. But I mean, come on. Those fireworks were awesome. <laughs> Phew. It was pretty cool when the place went. <laughs> Now we just need to quietly slip out of this cavern and we're home free. One problem huh? with that, Eli. How are we supposed to slip out with these everywhere? Okay, you know what? This is unacceptable. Even Pronto thinks this is bad. Bad? It, it's horrible. Where is the bravado? The genius. Ah. See? Now, that is a wanted poster. Hate to rush an artist at work, but we need an exit? Which is precisely why I, in my wisdom, have led us here. Uh, to a dead end? No cord, not to a dead end! <laughs> to our daring escape route! What is this place? Why, the flumes, of course. The Under River. You know, I was uh, quite the nautical mole in my day. What day was that? <laughs> mm, I think it was a Tuesday. I've heard of this place, a waterway under Slug Terra. Most people stopped using it when I was a kid. They're coming! And we've got nowhere to run! Our mechs and swim for it? I got a better idea. Cool. Wow. Show off. I modded yours too. The yellow button. <laughs> the Shane Gang are heading south in the flumes. I didn't know a Metha Beast could shred like this. Oh, there's a lot these babies can do. I just wish they could also keep me dry. Dude, for real? You don't like water? Let's just say I take one bath a year and uh, it's under protest, all right? Yes, and I protest you only taking one bath a year. <laughs> so hardly anyone uses the flumes anymore? 
Why? Ah, who wants wet, wetty wetness when you can ride in luxury on this like Telvin Express? to say it. Hands in the air, princesses! You trespassers face Malvolio Drake, master of the Cavern Seas! Whoa, 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 wait! So we didn't mean to trespass. We just kinda, um, ended up here. Oh, here is Undertow Cavern, princesses, where the business belongs to yours truly. What business is that? What I look like to you, an accountant, a basket weaver? <laughs> <laughs> I'm in the pirate racket, and if you want to pass, the ransom is half your slugs. And if we refuse? Then I'll be a few slugs poorer, and you'll be short too! <laughs> Not if they can't catch us! That's the plan, Eli. Come on. Our mecha's gotta be faster than a huge honking boat like that. I don't think the ship is trying to catch up to us. Mr. Watts! Yes, Captain. Show them what a barrage of frost crawlers can do. They've got cannons? Don't tell me they fire. We've put so much distance between us, we're out of range. I think... Don't say it. We're in the clear! We have got to stop saying that kind of stuff. Ready, Burpee? Well, that is exactly what I was going to do. Not so tough without your cannons, huh? huh? Can I take that back? Give them everything we've got! <laughs> oh, no. Run! your offer, and we'll happily give you some of our slugs now. <laughs> ha! Nice try, Morpheus, but the price has gone up. Now it's all your slugs. <gasps> and your enthusiastic servitude. Nothing personal, princesses. <laughs> <laughs> 
This can't get any worse. Ugh. Yeah, it can. I can't feel my toes. I'm pretty sure some of these barnacles have barnacles. This is impossible. But that's because on a ship, you must scrub counterclockwise. <laughs> now, listen to me, and I will tell you in excruciating detail exactly what you're doing wrong and how I know better. And you said this couldn't get any worse. Attention, deck monkeys. Captain Drake on deck. <laughs> I thought you said this wasn't personal. Don't flatter yourself, princess. I'm a pirate. Making you do my chores for me. It's just another day at the office. Doesn't seem like you're doing a good job, though. That's what Proto was saying. It should be done counterclockwise, like... <laughs> 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 Now this one is wasted on deck monkey duties. <laughs> you see? A man who recognizes seafaring skills. Yeah, I do, and you don't got any. But on the cold, empty sea, good distractions are hard to find. Uh, how would you like to be my new cabin mole? <laughs> A promotion? <laughs> <clears throat> so, uh, what sort of perks come with the title? The perk of not being tossed to the sharks over that there plank! Give him the heave -ho, boys! Oh! Oi, that's cold! In that case, I humbly accept. Now then, the reason I graced you lot with my presence, it's time to get down to the real business. <laughs> of all my ill-gotten treasure, this is the prize of my collection. Behold, every toenail clipping I've had since pirate school. Beautiful, ain't it? <sighs> Why would you do that? Because every part of me is special. Toenails are no exception. <laughs> Burpee! You guys okay? <clears throat> You've got hundreds of slugs in there. What do you even need them all for? For? For having the most slugs. That's how you play the pirate game. Guy with the most slugs wins. <laughs> Don't! Stay away from my Mimki princess. This little guy's more valuable than all you deck monkeys put together. And don't even think about trying anything other than cataloging my collection. Fang will be watching. Now get to work, deck monkeys! Ah, so, uh, just deck monkeys then, not cabin moles. Oh no, I got something much better for you, mole face. Oh, <laughs> better? Ah! Oh, Rato does not want to be cabin mole anymore. Make it stop. Make it stop! <laughs> huh? ah! oh, no. Okay, so even if we got past Fang, our mechas are locked away and we're surrounded by sharks and pirates. Yeah, and worst of all, while well, we're down here, Pronto's up there partying. This isn't Pronto's fault, it's mine. I got us into this by attacking that refinery without a plan. You are harboring persons wanted by Dr. Black. Turn them over and you will not be harmed. Sounds like an opportunity to make an exit. Wait, maybe we should come up with a plan first? Fire cannons. How's this plan? Hang on! <laughs> It's locked. We're trapped. Burpee, you guys all right? Burpee? It's one of Black's ships. The only way we're getting out of here is if they blast us out. <laughs> Guess we can go now. <laughs> Mr. Pirate, get me down! Why? You're drawing the fire perfectly up there. <laughs> But I'm your cabin mole! Yeah, and you're doing what cabin moles are good for, providing a distraction! <laughs> ah! 
Your boss can put Big Daddy Drake out of business with that train of his? What makes you think you can start now? You losers better learn what's mine stays mine! That's not exactly true, sir. The prisoners are escaping, and they've got our treasure. Well, except for the toenails. He pirated me? You don't pirate a pirate! That's a double pirate! Blast them! We have to reload before we can fire. Then do it! Now! I gotta get these running. We're not going anywhere. We'll cover you. <laughs> what do you say? Think he suffered enough? Yeah. Captain Malpronto, reporting for duty. Cannons reloaded, sir. Mr. Watts, you know how I always say it's a waste to sink a ship when you can capture the crew? Yes, sir. Feel free to waste this one. None of them are getting out of this alive. Them into pulp. Yeah! <laughs> Haven't seen a battle plan this for since pirate school. Bring us three degrees starboard and we've got him! He's gonna slug us to pieces! All right, we're outgunned, outmanned, and facing a ship twice our size. Don't worry, this time, I've got a plan. We lose him in that fog bank ahead. Hang on, everyone! He's headed for the breakers. He'll never make it through. This fool's even more clueless than I thought. Put us around the other side, and we'll clean up after. I should have tried this planning thing years ago. Rocks! <laughs> Eli? In a ship seems to work for him. Uh, how's it going? Well, let's see. Uh, you stole my treasure, broke my ship, but here's where I out pirate you. Sir, she's going down. If we want to live to play the Pirate game another day. If my ship goes down, I go with it, and so does he! Well, Captain's off the deep end, boys. Unless you fancy being shark food, we've got to take that other boat. Uh. Uh. 
All right, Memke. This one's all yours. <laughs> That's what a Mimki does, Princess! Perfectly mimics anything a slug can do! Look! There's our rides! Relying on a powerful slug like that in furnace is normally an excellent battle plan, but not when you're up against my Mimki. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm kind of new at this whole planning thing. Let's go. <laughs> Did you honestly think I'd use Burpee again? Huh. I guess I'm getting better at this planning thing after all. Hey, Eli! <laughs> so, what do you think of Drake's new boat? <laughs> Cute. Your despicable behavior brings shame to the tradition of tavern mulling. So, I quit. <laughs> Remember, counterclockwise. Nothing personal, princess. No! Me slugs, come back with me, treasure! You can't pilot a pirate! You know, Eli, with all of Drake's captured slugs, you could have yourself one heck of an arsenal. You're right. I could. But that's not how I play the pirate game. So, how do you want to get back home? I guess we could take the flumes now that those pirates are out of business. Oh, no. No way. I've had enough water to last me five years with the showers. You really want to smell what happens when I don't shower for ten? Let's take the road. Yeah, road. The road sounds good. <laughs> 